Ah, there you all are. Why aren't any of you at your desks? You're supposed to be working. Yeah, I'd love to be, but the servers are down. Without network access, we're stuck in an analog world. And Kevin won't let us erase the whiteboards. Look, it says do not erase right on it. What part of that isn't clear? Dude, you don't even know what that stuff means. That doesn't mean it's not important. Well, don't we have a network admin or something? Yeah, she works remotely from Argentina. We can't get a hold of her. Excuses! Go give the server a good kick or something. That's in Argentina too. Look, sometimes servers just go down. It's Mother Nature's way. Not this time it isn't. It's not the server's fault. Someone sabotaged our modem. <gasps> Sabotage. Oh, wow. Look at that. There's only one explanation for all this. Um, there is? This is Bruce's handiwork. If Bruce thinks he can out-espionage old Jeb, he's a fool. You hear that, Bruce? You may think you're so smart, but there's a time for planning and a time for action. And a time for action planning. I'll be in my office action planning. Look busy, everyone. Don't let the scoundrels get to your morale. Um, okay, so who's Bruce? I don't know, some rich guy Jeb's been obsessed with forever. Who knows if he's even real? Yeah, well, maybe he's onto something. A lot of strange stuff has been happening. Javier exploded, Kevin's computer was stolen, that weird faceless guy showed up. And don't forget about Sally. And that's not even everything. I'm gonna go talk to Jeb. Hey Jeb, can I talk to you for a second? Is this important? Action planning is a priority one item. Bigger than priority one, even. B priority two. Uh, yeah. So, Jonah and I found something weird the other day. She said it's a listening device. A what? A bug. A bug? Bruce has taken this further than I thought. He's relentless. Really? You think Bruce planted this? Close the door. And then make sure it's the closest it can be. You can't be too careful. Okay, so why do you think this Bruce guy planted this? Let's just say it's what I would do if I were Bruce and he were me and I wanted to steal my ideas. You see, Bruce runs a nearby game studio. Okay. Blood Diamond Studios. What? No way. Blood Diamond Studios? Shh. Not so loud. There may be other bugs. We should be stage whispering. You're joking, right? They're the biggest game dev on the East Coast. Whisper! Why would they care about us? They're massive. Yeah, because they stole their massive ideas from me. World of Catapults, big game, right? My idea! We can't let them take our shark surfing game thing, too. Dude, no one is going to take our game idea. I know. Because you're going to infiltrate them. What? No way, dude. You're in this deep now, and so is Joan. Both of you are going. I'm not going to sneak into some big-ass game office just to find you proof of some conspiracy. Stage whisper. Who said anything about proof? I have all the proof I need right here. In your stomach? In my gut. I feel it. Deep down in my business acumen. You just need to deliver a message. You, Joan, I I don't know, grab someone else too. Get to Blood Diamond Studios. Find Bruce and give him that. And I want you to look Bruce in those cold eyes and tell him, Jeb remembers. Jeb remembers everything. Now go. I need to do more action planning. Tell Bruce, Ben. You tell him I remember. I have no idea what's in these file cabinets, and I don't want to know. Uh, I don't think I want to go poking around Jeb stuff. Jeb, why is there a spoon stuck in your monitor? Look, I don't want to talk about my computer problems. Don't get distracted, Ben. Yeah, there's no way I'm going down to ask the engineers. I'll never make it back up. What am I doing in here? I should be seeing who wants to come with me. Hey, Kevin. 
You up for a field trip? Not unless it's a secret mission. I only have bandwidth for super cool secret missions today. Uh, well, I guess it is. Okay, I'm in. Hey, Pylon. Up for a field trip? Right now, my friend. I'm going to investigate this modem. A detective's job is never done. Yeah, you have fun with that. I don't know what it is with Pylon and Ketchup, or why he hides a bunch of bottles up there. Maybe someday we'll use this meeting room again to, no, oh, meet. I'm never doing another flip again. When I find out who added the sewer level to this thing, someone's gonna pay. Hey, Joan, you know that bug you found? Jab wants us to go investigate it. Oh, how exciting! Yeah, whoever made that bug definitely had Soviet training at some point. How do you know that? You know what? Never mind. Just meet me at the door. Hey, Midge, want to join me on a field trip? We found a planted microphone, and Jeb wants me to investigate. Oh, that's weird. It had a weird umbrella logo on it. Anyway, you in? Oh, uh, no. I've got a meeting later on, a doctor's appointment. Cool. Good luck with that. You know, I think this cactus belonged to Javier originally. I think he'd be happy that Midge is taking care of it. Hey, Viper, you actually getting work done? I don't need the network to make magic, okay? I just need me. Okay, I guess I'll let you focus then. This is Blue Jay. You may not know it, but Blue Jays are the biggest jerks there are in the animal kingdom. Blue Jay lives up to his name. He's a terrible neighbor. He's the head of the HOA in his neighborhood. Hey, Timothy, you up for a field trip? I'm sorry, I can't do that. <sighs> yeah, well, can't see I blame you. Hello, New England. I'm Rebel Breeze, and today I'm in... Julie? Damn it, go away! Let's see what's on the old mid-32C today. Not touching the fridge. Sally's in there. You know, where do we even get an office tentacle? And why does she like the fridge so much? I guess there's a chance that all that coffee made Kevin super smart or something, but I really don't think so.
merchandise bag, not Jade. Is your mind blown yet? Just wait until we start talking games. Francine, Jeb wants me to go out and do some, uh, research. You want to come? Gee, I would. But someone has to go to the store and buy a new cable for the modem. Guess who that someone is? Uh, Timothy? I'm sorry. I can't do that. Hey, intern. You up for a drive? Sure, but can I be inside the car this time? I don't know if I feel safe with even one hammer in this place. Alright, looks like this is everyone. I can't believe we're going to go through this. I know. I'm so excited. Me too. Where are we going? On a secret mission, intern. It's a need-to-know basis only. But worry not, for we are the ones who need to know. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna need you to tone down the Kevin a bit. Okay, Kevin? Right. Cool. Let's get this over with. Okay, so yeah, fences, guards, minefields, a high security gate. They really want to keep people out. This is so thrilling. I'm so glad I could come. Ooh, razor welded barbed wire. You know, that's the good stuff. Yeah, okay, so here's the plan. We just go over there, snap a selfie, and then we tell Jeb we tried and failed. Nonsense! We have not yet begun to fail! They sure do have a lot of catapults. Well, that's on brand for them. Their main game is World of Catapults. Oh, is that Blood Diamond Studios? I've read all about their campus. They surround the whole place with a minebolt minefield. Right then. We stick to the road, remember the plan. Right. We have to give Bruce a message. Let's drive down there and pretend we're employees. Yeah, let's not do either of those things. But that's what Jeb wants. You all take the road, I'll infiltrate from above. Rendezvous at the checkpoint at 1300 hours. What? No going rogue. But that's my strength. Look, okay, we'll try the dumb pretend to be employees plan, okay? Then we're out of here. Oh, and I can pretend to be an intern. What the hell did I get myself into? Onward, Ben! Hey there. ID cards, please. Hi, uh, we don't have them. We're new employees. Uh, we're here for orientation. C quick, we're late. Oh, really? Well, it's about time. They've been waiting for y'all for 15 minutes. Which one's Alice? Ah, uh, me? Great. Here's your temp patch. You get your real one later today. Uh, you're Simon, right? Uh, right. Yes. Simon. Here you go. And that leaves uh, Kombu. Me, yes. Uh, I am totally Kombu. Excellent. That's an interesting name, Kombu. It's a uh, Kelpish. And this is my pet crate. Oh, hi. I'm very excited to be here. Yeah, not the weirdest thing I've seen come through here. Better get on in there. Don't keep Chudley and Bradley waiting. Okay, then. Awesome. Thanks. Oh, hey. Be the diamond you want to see in the world. What? Uh, right. Right. Oh, whoa. Look at this place. Look at all those catapults. This is much cooler than our studio. Is this what a real game studio looks like? Dude, what the hell? Oh, there's even a breakfast buffet. <laughs> Do you think they have boot cut bacon? I love boot cut bacon. Hey, you there. We've been waiting for you. Come on over. I'm Chudley, and this is Brent. We're artists, senior artists. This is a heck of a facility y'all got here. We know. Let's get this started. Welcome to Blood Diamond. Be the diamond you want to see in the world. You're here because you're going to be the best. But you're not right now, because we are. Everything you need is within these walls. Food, entertainment, and meaningful work that goes out to millions of fans. You got no reason to ever leave. Ever. Ever. 
and you'll learn. Here at Blood Diamond, we're so much more than a studio. Right, Bradley? Right, Chudley. We're much more than a studio. We're a way of life. Right, Chudley? Right, Bradley. And actually, we're much more than a way of life, too. We are family. Right, Bradley? Right, Chudley. But we're more than a family. We also made an eternal blood pact to each other. Right, Chudley? Right, Bradley. And we're so in tune with each other, we can even finish each other's... Right, Chudley. Right. So, that's what happens when you are the best. All right? Questions? Uh, do we all need to make blood pacts, too? Not unless you're the best. Hey, Bradley, why does talking to new hires like this always make me feel so good? I don't know, Chudley. Why? Because it reminds me, I'm not them. <laughs> oh, yeah. It feels pretty good to not be them. Totally. Okay, orientation done. Have a look around at our impressive catapults. We'll do a tour, once you all are sufficiently impressed. Right, Bradley? Right, Chudley. Be the diamond, people. Well, they seem nice. Uh, can we look around, Ben? I guess, for a minute. And then let's get out of here. Do you think someday Shovelwork Studio will be a real studio like this one? Oh, this was from the Dark Future update. It takes place in 2099 and humanity has been overrun by sentient catapults and the only ammo left is enriched uranium barrels. Oh, great game. Man, this catapult is life-size. I guess they take these things to conventions. They probably go to a bunch of them. Bradley and Chudley are so cool. I want to be like them someday. This was from the update where they go to Clown Gorge. It was called World of Catapults, Bolly Bolly Valley. These catapults are actually functional? You bet your tail they are. Every catapult on campus is fully functional and dangerous. Safety first, okay? Did you see the line of catapults outside by the fence? Fully functional, you know. At the summer picnic, we go for distance records. These outline the history of the Blood Diamond family. You know, I know Bruce personally. You should feel impressed. I don't want to go wandering off quite yet. Dang, this lobby is huge. I heard the studio even had a spa on site. <laughs> I've never seen pie at a buffet served like this. Whoa, check out this buffet. Hey, look, they have diamond-shaped candy canes. Why don't we have those? Ooh, this is pretty thick bacon. Do you think this is boot-cut bacon? so much. There are 137 unlockable catapults and I have all of them.
This table looks kind of dangerous. Is this a tourism brochure for this very lobby? Man, how come we don't have a reception desk? Huh, I wonder what's down that way. Do you want to be the diamond too, friend? Big studio. Yeah, we unlocked the campus tech tree after we shipped World of Catapults. Ah, dang, this looks like a vintage catapult game. Doesn't seem to work though. Oh, look, they have a cabinet of one of their first games Catapult Capitulate. I love this game as a kid. Nice try, new employee, but no one's leaving here. You'd only end up wandering off into the Minopult field. They probably spent more making this lobby than Shovelworks has made in its entire existence. Don't go up those stairs. Nothing up there but the executive offices. Whoa. Are these things real? Everything is real here at Blood Diamond. We don't fake anything. to the artist alley. We'll get there later on our tour. Psst. Man, I see you there. Meet me in the South Hall if you want to get out of here alive. Uh, hello? How do you know my name? South Hall. Meet me there. Who are you? Hello? Okay. Didn't expect that. Hey, y'all hear any strange voices calling to you from vents? Uh, no. Not today. <laughs> well, whatever. Look, this place is massive. I think we need a plan. Me too. You and Kevin distract them. I'll take the stairs and rendezvous at the checkpoint at 1300 hours. Joan, stop that. We don't have a checkpoint and we're not splitting up. This is supposed to be quick and simple. You there! Stop! That is not the real Kambu. Or Alice, or Simon. They're imposters! We're the real ones! What? Imposters? Get them! Oh no! <laughs> Retreat, team! I got him, Chudley. Damn it, you all aren't going anywhere. And no employees get out of here without a day pass. Right, Chudley? Bradley, these aren't real employees. We are too. Just not yours. Uh, well, your loser bosses are going to be out of some staff. Quick, that way. Should we chase them? Let them run. There's no way out of here. Ah, there you are. You wanted to speak with us? Are you bugging the studio? We make an effort to keep tabs on your efforts to sabotage their efforts. Yeah, well, now everyone's on the lookout for suspicious things. This is already difficult enough. Your efforts have not been fruitful thus far. You think? For everything wrong I do, someone else is doing something right to the game. 
Interesting. Are you saying there's another agent? The director will need to hear of this. Whatever it is, I'm sick of it. We shall contemplate this. Until then, carry on, Miss Potter. They must not make a good game. Yeah, uh, yeah, I know already. Hey, what's with the umbrella? It's not an umbrella, Miss Potter. It's a parasol. Blocks the sun. Whew. Okay. I think we lost them, at least for the moment. Oh, man. They were creepy. Yeah, now how do we get out of here? Hey, are we in the South Hall? That voice back in the lobby told us to come here. What voice? Ben! That one, over there! Frank? Quick, in here! Holy crap! Frank! Kevin, you remember Frank, right? Hey, Joan, I used to work with this guy. Frank, what the hell, man? Get tired of being a professor? Yeah, I decided to get out of academia. I figured this would be better. No offense, dude, but you don't look better. Yeah, turns out this place wasn't for me either. But you can't just sneak out. They're pretty clicky here. Yeah, we noticed. They went into lockdown the moment we tried to leave. This is how it normally is. They only open it up during recruitment drives. Aw, oh, man. What do we get ourselves into? Damn it, Jeb. Well, this just won't do. I have to report to my parole officer every 48 hours. Yeah. Yeah, I've been trying to break out forever. I was going to make a run for the doors when I saw you, Ben. But now that you're here, we might have a chance. I've been watching them. Memorizing the guard patrols, stealing from the catered lunches, learning their weaknesses. Take a look at this. Right now, we're here in this utility closet. We start by digging down, right below us. Dig through. Concrete. Don't worry. They have diamond tip shovels. Eventually, we'll get to the machine room. Ooh, there's a machine room? Yeah. There are a lot of flames and spikes and chomper walls. Excuse me, chomper walls? Yeah. Once we get through that, we'll get to this substation where the lockdown controls are. There are three switches we need to hit simultaneously in order to escape. And then we just have to watch out for the Minapult field and we're home free. Huh. You sound like you got this all figured out. I've just been waiting for the right partners. Everyone else is too happy to be here. And I can't do this alone. I needed someone like you three. Us three? There are four of Wait a second. Where's the intern? Intern! Hello? Damn it, intern! Well, we can't help you anyway. We have to go find this boss guy. Joan, we're not going after Bruce. We have to get out of here. Bruce? Bruce the CEO? Oh, man. You know how to get to him? There's a way. Take a look at this. Okay, look, his office is here. You gotta go up, up through this elevator shaft. Then there's a machine room where there are lots of flames and spikes and chomper walls. Dude, hold it. Do you have any routes that don't involve chomper walls? Why do they even have chomper walls? All big complexes have chomper walls, Ben. That's architecture 101. What about going in the window? Executive offices always have windows. Huh. Well, Bruce's office does overlook the courtyard. Guess that's an option. You leave it to me, I'll get what we need. Just rendezvous at the checkpoint at 1300 hours. <sighs> Joan, what checkpoint? Joan? Joan! Damn it. <sighs> we are never getting out of here. Chin up, Ben. First things first, take down the lockdown. Then we'll get the intern and Joan. We just have to stay focused on the task at hand. Oh yeah? What's that? Digging. You find me that report, James. And Addy, don't forget to check in on the projects. I want a status report by tomorrow. Right on time. Ooh, that was a lot of digging. It was, but we're not done yet. Welcome to the machine room. Ooh, no building needs this. Oh, they're super common. I bet your building has one too. No way. Our building is like 200 years old. Well, it might be steam powered, but it's there. Go find it someday. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going in that thing. No one's gonna survive that. There's a pattern. I I'm sure of it. It doesn't matter if there's a pattern. We're still all gonna get chomped up. Ain't no way all of us are gonna get through there. Only one of us needs to. There's a shutoff on the other side. I'll do it. The hell you will, dude! This is where my designer brain can be useful. I can see the patterns. I know I can sometimes be wildly over-optimistic. 
but but trust me, I've got this. I think I could see sense in this. Don't believe it. I heard that. I am amazing. Great. There should be a shutoff button somewhere. All right. Let's see. Uh, okay. Got it. That wasn't it. Uh, I guess you'll just have to go through it too uh, without the uh, lights. Go up. Dude, what? There's no way. You can do it, Ben. Oh, got it. Sorry about that. Ooh, that did it, dude. Guys, you'll never guess what's over here. You must be Bruce. I'm sorry, did I have a meeting? Did Addy let you in? I let myself in. I'm here to deliver a message. What is this? Who are you? The message is... Jeb remembers everything. Oh. Uh, what? Who the hell is Jeb? I thought you might say that. I'd like to ask you some questions. We can either do this the easy way, or the plier way. Security! Get in here! I disconnected that button. Look, lady, I don't know anyone named Jeb. Does this mean anything to you? Where did you get that? You tell me. 
If I knew the answer to that, I wouldn't have asked. Okay, so we're doing this the plier way then. Wait, no! I have no idea who Jeb is, but I know that logo. Oh yeah? Let's have a chat. Why would anyone ever build this many catapults? Oh, they use them for conventions. They do a lot of conventions. Okay, so we open that door and we're home free? Right, this is why I needed help. It's a three-step process. Ben, you take that button and you take that one, I'll take the button by the door. We must push them at the same time and the gate should lift. Okay, on my mark. Three, two, one. It's up! Great! Keep holding those buttons! It's the only thing keeping the gate up! What? What the hell, dude? You didn't tell us that. Frank, man, what about us? Don't worry, the catered lunches are actually really, really good! Thanks for helping me out! Really, Frank? Come on, dude! Good seeing you, Ben! Gotta run! He is totally not a good role model. Yeah, just when you think you know a guy. Think he'll remember about the Minapult field? The what? Guess not. Okay, uh, now, how do we get out of here? You don't. It's impressive you got this far, but we figured you'd end up down here. Right, Bradley? Right, Chudley. You all were playing checkers, but we were playing one-dimensional chess. Hey, what do you think about sending these jokers on a one-way catapult ride? Yeah, one-way catapult rides. Dude, seriously? All catapult rides are one-way. Can it, smartass? <laughs> Get in, guys! Intern! Nice timing! Let's go, Kevin! Get them! Did you put rocket launchers on this thing? Yeah! My generation just loves rocket launchers! Heads up! Looks like we're in for a fight! Incoming! can take a beating. Watch out! Firing mine to pull payload! Fire the mine to pull payload! thought we were done for. Thanks for coming to our rescue, intern. I'm not sure how we got out of there alive. Now, what do we do about Joan? About time you all showed up. Joan? I told you all meet at the rendezvous point. Slow pokes. Okay, then. Did you deliver the message? Oh, I think he got the message. Oh, stupid damn losers. Come on, Chudley. Let's get back to making real games.
Bradley, Chudley, I have a new task for you two. You'll be spending a bit of time away from the office. But we love the office, right, Bradley? Right, Chudley. It's the best. I know. But we must keep an eye on our new friends. We can go bring them back. We have more catapults. No, no, no. I want this done casually. And I want you to look for certain things. Uh, like coupons? We come away from today's events with something new. Something quite unexpected.